Hello everyone, Merry Christmas, it's James in Japan. It is December 25th, 2022. You're looking at a new Japanese scratch ticket called One Piece Scratch Luffy 7 New Year's Day New Year Challenge. It just came out yesterday and this is for game 949. There are two games in one. It cost 300 yen. The jackpot is Sons and Mun En. This game is about Karuta. That is a Japanese card game, which is equivalent to Snap Em Up in English. This is the scratch area, and there are 12 boxes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 boxes. There is Japanese writing, Japanese kanji on these cards. The top says Yomi Fuda, which means reading tags. And the bottom kanji reads E Fuda, which means picture cards. You need to match sets. You need to match at least one set in order to win the sixth prize. That is Ichigumi. So a kumi, a set, would be top and bottom. So that would be one set, all right? This is two sets, three sets, four sets, five sets, six sets. And these are the corresponding prizes. So if you get one matching pair, one set, you win the sixth prize, Sambyakuen. If you get two sets, Nikumi, that is the fifth prize, you win Sen En. If you get three sets, Sangumi, that is the fourth prize, you win Ichiman En. If you get four sets, Yongumi, that is the third prize, you win Juman En. If you get five sets, Gokumi, you win the second prize, Hyakuman En. And if you get six sets, Rokugumi, you win the jackpot, Sanzenman En. I think that's 30 million yen. That's a lot of money. So this is for game one. For game two, that is Waku Waku Otoshidama. That means New Year's gift money. You're going to scratch this red box. If you find this picture here, you win the sixth prize, Sambyakuen. Don't scratch here. You have until January 30th, Reiwa 6. That is 2024 to claim your prize. Quickly looking at the back. Here is a breakdown of the prizes and the rules in Japanese. If you happen to win the first prize or anything over Juman, you need to fill in this area. Here you will write your prefecture, then your full name, then your address in Japan. All winnings are tax-free in Japan. And even tourists can play this game. So if you have a big winning ticket, you need to take this to Mizuho Bank, that is Mizuho Ginko. Okay, that is the issuing that is the issuing bank. Alright guys, I've got one ticket and this is my first time. Hopefully I explained this right. I only have 10 yen with me. So, scratch anywhere you want. Remember, we need to find a set. So, the top and bottom should match. Let's start from the left corner. This is the reading tag. And what does it say? Fujisan, like in Mount Fuji. Nope. That does not match. Next. Koma. Koma means top, like a spinning top. Fuji, this is Mount Fuji. So we needed this picture here. No good. These are traditional pictures. Mochi, that is sticky rice cake. Uh, koma, this is the top. We needed this picture here. No sets yet. Hago Ita. That is a battle door. It's a kind of rectangular board with a pattern. I'm not sure.
not that. Okay, you know what? I didn't point out that each of these pictures have a hiragana letter. Here it says ta, here it says fu, here it says ko. Ko matches this ko. Fu matches this fu. Ta doesn't match anything. Okay, and uh, this is mo. That would be mochi. And we needed this picture here. Hopefully you're not confused. Kadomatsu. That is a traditional Japanese decoration made of bamboo. Uh, okay, uh, that is for New Year's. This one has ha. This ha matches this picture. So that would be over here. No good. Okay, this is my last set. What do you think, guys? Am I going to win anything for game one? Come on. This is Daruma. It is a traditional red doll. It's hollow and round. It looks weird. Ka. No matches. So I lost. If you're unsure, check the lettering in these black boxes. They have to match. This writing is called hiragana. Okay? So they don't match. If they match, you get a set. So you add up the sets to win bigger prizes. Okay, let's go to game two. Batsu. I lost. Damn. So this is how to play one Piece Scratch Game 949. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to my channel.